Car enthusiasts have been camping out all week in anticipation of the Syracuse Nationals car show starting tomorrow at the fairgrounds. We've been checking out the Erie Canal actually. The museum, the canal, the locks, eating, drinking, being merry. <laughs> have a great time and go all the way to Camping World and spend money, go to Walmart and spend money, <laughs> go to Baldwinsville and spend money. Just have a great time. Spend a lot of money. Spend a lot of money. <laughs> And while they wait to see the cars, they're bringing money to area businesses. It's not just the car show, it's uh, all of Central New York what it has to offer. They'll take maybe take a day trip, if they come in early in the week, they'll take a day trip maybe to the Finger Lakes, to the wine country, or maybe they'll go to the casino or up to the Thousand Islands, go to Alex Bay for a day. Some have been camping out since Sunday. Those early birds are giving business to local attractions. One vendor is hoping some of that money comes into his pocket. This is the biggest show that we do as far as the number of people here. So if we're going to make any money, this is the one we're going to make it at. Some of the proceeds from the weekend go directly to charity. 64 airbrush artists will be on hand to create one-of-a-kind artwork. All proceeds will go to the McMahon Ryan Child Advocacy Center. More than 80,000 people, including some from as far away as Great Britain, Australia and New Zealand, are expected to attend. Adult tickets are $17 at the gate. In Syracuse, I'm Katie Corrado.